Hey guys, today we're going to show you how to make tilapia fish bakura on Be Inspired with Mother and Daughter channel. we also show you how to take out the tilapia fish fillets. So let's get started with the video. So first we're just going to show you how to cut out fish fillets from your tilapia fish. So just take off the skin, firstly. So that's done. If you want to find out how to cut off the head of the tilapia fish and the side and how to clean it, we have a video. I'll link in the description below. So we're just going to cut it through the middle to make it into a fillet. So we've got one fillet. this into chunks so all this fish has no fish bone in it so we have one bowl of boneless fish we're using tilapia fish fillets half a cup of ground flour or basin a quarter cup of shredded coconut unsweetened a quarter cup of coriander leaves two tablespoons of lemon juice Coriander powder, one tablespoon. Chat musala, one teaspoon. If you want to know how to make homemade chat musala, check the link in the description. And red chilli powder to taste. Salt to taste. Water required. Firstly, we're going to sieve in our basin of gram flour to prevent any lumps. Now we're going to put in our shredded coconut. This is just to give a little bit of extra crunch and it's unsweetened. Our coriander leaves. The shredded coconut gives the extra taste that makes our fish papunas very delicious. Lemon juice for tanginess. Our spices. Salt. Give that a little whisk, or you can mix it with a spoon. The salt ingredients are combined, and then pour it in your water to get a nice paste. Now put in your fish, Mix that in so it's going to be well marinated. Your fish shouldn't be running in the paste. It should be like this. And we're going to leave it to rest for five minutes. Heat up oil in a pan and you're going to deep fry your fish fakudas. So you're going to take them out once they're golden brown. When it's like really sizzling and bubbly, shake the pan so it moves around. You need to do this so the fish doesn't burn. But if you use a spoon of some sort, the fish will break. Make sure you fry it on a high flame. Now, once you reach to this bit, so it's hardened, you're able to move it around. And the fish won't break. Remember to fry it until golden brown. Now once you reach golden brown, we're taking them out. Make sure you drain up the oil. So here we have a simple easy tutorial on how to make tilapia fish fakuda. It's very delicious and crispy, especially with the unsweetened coconut, our little trick. 
So be inspired, try new things and conquer amazing skills and like and subscribe and comment down below and check out our other videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.